everyone, welcome back to my channel, your HR Connect here. And today I wanna to discuss how you can convert a military resume over to a civilian resume leveraging ChatGPT. As a TA professional, I'm often asked by job seekers, but also my peers, such as recruiters and sourcers, on how can we translate this information to be able to put individuals in the correct position or also give guidance to military uh, veterans on how they can translate their resume to put themselves in the best position to land their next position in the civilian world. With ChatGPT, the platform has the amazing ability to be able to understand and translate military terms over to civilian terms. And to give you an example of that, if someone had on their job title, they were a soldier, and it's a, in the military world, that would mean they're a soldier on the front line. But in regards to converting that over to civilian terms, that would translate in the workplace as an operations specialist. So today I'm going to give you a high level overview on how ChatGPT can translate the military resume over to the civilian resume to give job seekers that, over, that overall advantage on how they can present themselves in the civilian world. Before I dive into the video, I'm going to request that you like, comment, and subscribe so you can stay up to speed with the latest content I'm going to deliver on a weekly basis and make sure you don't miss any of this, any of this information I'm going to provide. So with that being said, here is the overview. Okay, so now that we have our resume, and you can see from the employment history, this person has a rich background supporting the U.S. Army. And as you can see in the job title, they have listed soldier from 2017 to present. And as you further look at the bullet points listed under the responsibilities as a soldier, you can see that the first bullet point indicates qualified expert in all five line weapon systems. The second bullet point indicated indicates that completed basic combat training and advanced individual training. The third bullet point indicated that this person excelled at a simulation and classroom combat training. And the final bullet point this individual has listed maintained 100% accountability of equipment, weapon systems, vehicles, and supplies valued at an assets of $15 million. So based on this individual's background, and someone who is a recruiter on the civilian side, I would not know how to translate this to understand how this unique background can fit in for roles I may have in my organization or maybe roles that I can pass on to a fellow recruiter who may be looking for someone with a skill set or even as, even as a candidate for perspective. They may not know how to translate this, but the great thing about AI is that AI is smart enough to have the capabilities to convert this resume over to a civilian resume. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna copy the job description, the job title, everything this person listed based on anything that's related to the US Army, and I'm gonna take it over to ChatGPT. So now I'm gonna ask ChatGPT to convert this military resume to a civilian resume, and let's see what the results uh, is discovered by ChatGPT. Okay, perfect. So ChatGPT was able to generate some results for us in regards to this individual's background. So as you can see, the position, the title has changed. It went from a soldier to a team member. It, do, it did have the duration and also the location. And it indicates that expertise in equipment operations, it was, ch it was changed to proficient in the use of and maintenance of diverse equipment systems. So that's they translated that from someone who indicated they have weapons experience. They translated this over to maintenance of diverse equipment and systems. So here's the hot hit. Here's the following. It focused on training and development. Opposed to talking about combat training, the training now talks about successfully comp completed rigorous training programs, emphasizing teamwork, discipline, and problem solving skills. Let's look at the third bullet point. It focused more on performance and under pressure. 
demonstrated the ability to excel in high stress environments, both simulated scenarios and, and classroom settings. Last bullet point talks about access management opposed to managing the budget and managing what equipment the, the U.S. Army was using. So, for example, it indicates the final bullet point oversaw and maintained responsibility for equipment, vehicles, and supplies valued over 15 million, ensuring 100% accountability and, my, and minimal loss. So, this is a great way to translate your resume from a military resume to a civilian resume leveraging ChatGPT. I hope you enjoyed this video and thought this video was insightful. That's something that you can incorporate in your day-to-day -day function as a recruiter or as a job seeker. Uh, please feel free to like, comment, and subscribe to the channel so you can stay up to speed with the latest videos and content that I'm gonna deliver on a weekly basis. And until next time, thanks for watching.